what a waste of troops that was by me. Oh, I'll just let him. I'll, I'll let him have another turn. I know what I'll do. I'll let him. Ha I'll let him cast one more spell. Idiot. Di diabolical. Terrible. Terrible decision making. I should have been spending money on a mage guild here as well. Where are we? Level 1? Level 2, yeah. Just to see if I can get her water walk, I think it would be a nice addition. Hell, even Dimension Door would be fine. She, she has tons of mana, she can cast it. Should probably have done that, but she's galloped out of there now. Right, you do this. Give me more junk. What else did I get? Uber frustrating. So what she's going to get done is today, day five, day six takes her to about here. Day seven means she's through here. Or she could go do this. Hmm. I feel like Gellar needs to learn some spells too, so I might just hire him back now. I don't have enough money to hire him. Now I do. Here we go. Come on back. Need money. Need like 800 bucks. Oh, this works out well, actually, because she can learn this stuff, none of which matters in the slightest. Okay. Yeah, here we go. So she's going to teach Clone Resurrection Sorrow and View Earth. Pretty decent. Not going to worry about it. Okay, Lapitha continues on her... What feels like her endless mission. Now you give me that, you take these things. Um, where are you going? Who wants the Ring of Vitality? It's somewhere in, it's someone in this immediate vicinity that wants it, right? Oh, these are all good upgrades, look at that. That's turned him into a much better hero. Plus three and plus two, okay. So I'll do it. Let your spells duration carry on. I think we're underground for that. Let me just check. It's down here, right? It's one of these somewhere down here. Quest log? No. Oh, it's the button I'm looking for, this thing. Right, where are you? You're here. Perfect, perfect. So I can trot down here and do that. So that was a waste of a move there, because um, I didn't actually give him his army. There you go, enjoy. Keep my trogs to myself, I think. Plus two, plus two, slightly better than plus three. Take that. I'll keep this. Already learned, already learned. Let's do the plan. I hope I don't get embarrassed here. Does he have? He doesn't know visions. How can she not have taught him visions? And the answer is that visions is in the spell book. 
not in her spellbook. Alright. Let's do this fight. It's fine, right? Type formation. <laughs> this, this is fine. Oh yeah, so yeah, she's got six spell points. Decent hero. I've got two unicorns. I think I'll be okay. Who strikes first, me? No, you. Okay, that stinks. That's the end of your spell points, though. So that's good. What? How many moves have you got? Don't blind me. Oof. Okay, right. Yeah, I guess if I'm ice bolted, I'm frost ringing, so I'll just do something. <coughs> it's hard to know. It's hard to know. Stand here. The will shoot me. Do this. Seven. Oh, well, that have done protection from fire. Ooh. Sorry, plus one. Plus one movement. Might be able to get the drop on them here. Yep, should be able to. So... So what does a nice bolt do? 283. It's 240. So they've got 260 health there, so I kill that stack with ice bolts. Kill the whites. Steal all of Chandra's stuff. Chana, what's your name? Chandra? Who am I thinking of the magic again? Yeah, give me your stuff. 51 of my girls. Are they worth buying in the late game? Maybe the answer is no, unless you've got a stack of like 900 of them. And you're trying to attack a castle. Yeah, Ring of the Wayfarer. I'm gonna collect the whole thing of Legion. I wonder what happens if I get all the pieces of Legion. He's gone up a level. Hello. And take the air mag. Wasn't massively impressed with his performance there, I must say. Um <clears throat> Okay. We're heading here. Losing my voice here, sorry. <clears throat> that means I've been talking too much. Okay, she took the shackles off, pause it here and come back once my voice picks up. I think we're okay, made some silly mistakes, but... Another quick look here. Come over here, these. And then we're gonna look down here. See what we can unlock. Poor guy's been standing here, just can't afford to do stuff. That's okay. Alright, and we're back um, the next day. I'm trying to remember what everything happened yesterday. We killed that vampire that had um, nearly killed Galar. Very, very lucky that he's still alive. Uh, extremely stupid of me to leave him with one stack of monsters that could have just been killed. I'm pretty satisfied that he's got enough here in this configuration that he can't be surprised that way again. Um, Although, there's a lesson there for all of us. We should be doing that. <laughs> uh, out of money. These heroes are still waiting around. Valeska might get confronted and defeated right now. But, okay. We've learnt something. One thing that... <laughs> if I'd known this was a conflux in this fortress area... It's a fortress area, as you can see. We've known that for ages. But if I'd known this was a conflux, then ages and ages ago we had a choice between trying to make progress through the red portal or the yellow... If I'd known, if I'd known that that was a conflux, I would have put everything we had into taking it, and then um, 
it's quite a different strategic outcome. You'd have p basically piling in on Conflux. You'd be investing really heavily in that town, that second town. As it stands, of course, what we have now is a patchwork. We've got, you know, 111 Grand Elves, nine Phoenixes, and then a bun and we've got Titans and Nagas. We've got a bit of everything. This is the way it panned out. So, yeah, it just goes to show how the game can hinge on little things like that. I think we had Sir Muluk in this area. Um, you guys can't see. Uh, Sir Muluk was standing here ready to discover that conflux, and Red came out and pipped him, came out of here, and then ran back, killed him, and, and ran back in again. If that hadn't happened, if I'd known that was there, um, it would have been a very different um, thing. And now, who knows? I don't know how strong Red is. I don't know how easy it's going to be to take it. I feel like if we take it in the next week, you know, we're going to be really hard to beat. So, anyway, let's see what happens. Valeska, is she going to get a comeuppance? She's not getting a comeuppance. Okay. She know ballistics? She's basic ballistics. This army won't be great at taking a castle. Um, we really desperately want to see what's underground here. It might get covered over by... I think there's a necropolis or a cover of darkness nearby. Um, or was that further down? It'd be interesting to see if that remains. Um, so I'm not sure what to do here. I can come down, obviously, and besiege the um, Conflux. I don't think I can take it. And I would note that they're the wrong troops as well for defending it. So even if they have Phoenixes here, that I mean, there's only one slot left there to fill. And the AI won't, like, disband like a throng of... Um, troglodytes to buy two phoenixes and stuff so there's it would be different if these were all conflux um, units I'd be more the the, uh, the need to conquer it quickly would be would be stronger or higher um, just trying to figure out what I want to do how, how I want to use this movement today I don't think there's any point besieging I think I'd rather do the exploring thing Golems here that haven't been beaten. Uh, and there's a road here. Kind of want to st stick to the road because get the best movement. Someone's helped him out already. Gem mine there could be good to get. Wouldn't mind seeing what that is. I can probably beat them. It's kind of just about establishing a, a re reconnaissance beachhead. Um, so it might be enough to just pop here. Yeah, I might just do that. Just trying to reveal some map here, really. Okay, there's some rocks there. Hello. These rocks look like... These rocks. I think we finally found... If I move the map to there... Yep, that's definitely them. You can see this edge of the wall here is that edge there. So the grail is about here somewhere. Got that bump. That bump is going to be around here. I think the grail... Oops, wrong button. Sorry. It's just a little bit south of the rocks. Should I get the scale right? And equidistant from the, to the wall, so I reckon the Grail is right where the horse is there. Is that something she could do? Is just start digging. That'd be incredible if we if we pull that off. Not 100% sure. Um, this guy is exploring. Let's allow him to continue. Can't beat a horde of Medusas, sadly. So he will have to come back around the long way. Um, and I'm 
it's not worth waiting around for the next week of imps. So let's just continue. Alamar can finally buy them. Let's just see what happens here. Oh yeah, I remember this. Hmm. Shakti's not someone we want to do that with. This guy would be better. Just get him back up there, go do it. Seems okay, right? Never went there, don't care, I'm not gonna do this. Can live without it. Come on back. Any reason not to come down and just do that? Might as well talk to her on the way. How you going? Just a quick opportunity to do a quick uh, fourth level unit. Okay, I can keep. I'll try and give that to Fury or the blue guy, whatever his name is. Um, your attack and defense are a bit better. My luck and morale are a bit better. Uh, look. Yeah, yeah. There's probably optimization to be done there, but. Just won't worry about it. Um, it's just a courtesy, courtesy check in. He's going to go down here and get the experience. So Shakti comes back to here, one way or the other. So there's nothing left for her to buy. Before I do head off, is there anything left for her to buy that I should have bought that I haven't bought yet that she could have? No, just day six. So I'm not going to wait around, two days is too much. I still don't think it's worth taking a detour to go there. That might be wrong. I'm going to choose here between this and Necropolis. If you're greedy, the game will punish, so... There's also this observatory someone could finally get around to unlocking. Day six, where's the necropolis likely to be? So there's a cover of darkness doing its thing here. So the necro is probably about like here. It's probably right here. Um, I don't need that plus two attack, not really. <sighs> yeah, it's right here, what's there? Okay, so what happens when I cast visions? Do I get to know the hero? Okay, maybe that means there isn't a hero. Which means I just get to shoot and resurrect. I'll just do all this afterwards. She's probably going to want to drop down here, do this. She could portal back, come to here, come to here. Damage the walls, it's my town, you know, you're wrecking there. Am I slowing everything? I'm probably not, right? Because these guys can't do morale, or they can get to me. Okay. And then, what can you guys do? How fast are you? 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I don't think they can get there. 1, 2, 3, 10. So they actually would land here. It's just the ghost dragons will fly over and annoyingly kill some elementals. Yeah, I'm happy, I'm happy with just killing these, right? I need 400 damage. Just kill them. Don't 
worry about the rest because morale morale triggers can't happen. And then we kill them. Yeah, that one's that's fine. Hmm. Oh, I didn't see that. They've got a whole other stack of them. Um. Let's wait. They'll fly over. And then they're just dead. I should think. Do this. Even though that could be annoying. I don't bother getting around to killing him. Okay, might be able to win now. Please just hit the elves. Nice. Okay, so if I get this right, um, I win right now and. Do these go first before the Gorgons? Yeah, so these guys shoot the Gorgons to death. These guys have to wait because they can't get past the Gorgons. I think that's right. This won't kill them. Oh, don't lose an end. That's what I was worried about. Um... Wait. I need the Death Knights to have waited. Have they waited? They have. But then they're going to go... The Gorgon's going to move. Oh, okay. Oh, maybe I need to do it this way then. Does that kill them? Maybe not. The Ice Elementals help me kill the Dread Knights. The Gorgon's going to move to there. I may have messed this up, I might be using more spell points than I need to, but what the hang. Mm, I think this kills the stack most of the time, it's possible that it won't. It will now. Helps to be lucky. This should kill them and then the Gorgons move to nowhere. They have no morale to speak of. That should kill them, right? Yeah. Do nothing, you guys move, but that's pointless. Unicorns can maybe just kill them. Yes, they can. Okay. Feel like manage that okay. None is good. So one ice bolt and one resurrect. That's that's pretty good. Um, what's in here? Fully built town, fully developed. Mage guild though is level three. Does she hilariously not know Lightning Bolt yet? Or Curse? She does. She knows them both. She's never going to use either of them in a million years. No other reason to come in here, is there? Necromancy Amplifier? She could transform her army into skeletons? Somewhere? Where is that? There? Um, all these noble creatures I could just exterminate and turn into skeletons. That was a sicko. So maybe I could... Oh, there's tons of stuff down here. Look at this. Great. Um... I was thinking about hiring a hero here. But now that we know where the Grail is, I kind of feel like that's a thing as well that we're going to want to prioritise. And I think the answer is yes. Make these purchases. Oh. Okay. I already cleared that out. 
So he's a bit of a waste, a waste of a hero here, isn't he? Wait, he has the torso? I have another torso? I have two torsos. Ah, okay. <laughs> so I forgot that. If you've watched these videos in a chain, you might be, have been screaming at me there. No, you already have a torso. Fiora already has a torso. I have two torsos. How many statues of Legion are there? You'd think that's, uh, it's a unique artifact, right? Oh well. Um, right, in order to make more energy elementals, you'll have to come back here then for the start of the week. And of course we want Alamar back for the elves as well at the start of the next week. So we'll get the unicorns. Day 7. Should have enough movement to get back. Let's find out. I don't think I want to buy anything else though, right? Except for maybe just some token... Um, token defenders. Um, and I'm keen to see now we should have a really good information advantage. Okay, they're up to black dragons. That's... It's kind of scary. These are bone dragons? Yeah. Okay, but we are winning the game now. We've pulled the arm over. We still need to have our big, massive fight with red. For all the marbles. Um, that will happen here. If Arkin can get up to here, he can add these to his black dragon army. Um, that could just be me being a bit of a scaredy cat. Anyway. Okay. Okay, I think what I saw there is that there's another necropolis over here. Um, because he came in and did some stuff and then ran back over here. Yeah, there is. There must be. How did I get here? <laughs> I, I got here. I got here from here, right? So, yeah. There's necropolis shenanigans afoot. Attacks better than defense because I have the shield. Happy to waste some mana to get back to here. Yeah, there's there's that that's where I came in. Okay, so he stuck his head in there. Um Maybe a little cold soul is the name of my town. Go here. Take the power. Do this, get some more attack skill. Okay, so it's cover of darkness, but it is sealed off. Where are we investing? Our seventh hero, our eighth hero, sorry. So I want to come to here and start digging. Ah, oh, damn, someone's already got it. It looks like someone's got it already. must be red and they've built the dungeon grail structure fair enough fair enough someone got there already that looks about bang on where it would be right I don't know what this means this means it's that the AI definitely has it Or is it still worth trying for it? I think it might be okay to just sit here and keep trying, just on the off chance, because we're kind of besieging this town. It's really hard to get to. Like I can't, I can't use town portal and stuff. If I had a water, water walk, or dimension door type mage. You know, I could just water walk over here. Or I could Dimension Door is even better than water walk. But because it's a town portal hero, I have to start from a town, and the closest town is actually my hometown. I have to come all the way over here, or the stupid tower, to get to that portal. If I had water walk, I could just walk over there, boom, and I'm connected. 
So conquering this town would be epic. With Valeska. Um, if she can pull it off. Spectacular. You know, for Labitha. Out in front locking the rest of the game. So on that basis I'm going to roll the dice with Valeska. We're taking the Conflux on. So on the road I will easily bring combat. I can see what looks like a red flag flying but I can't see... So it could be that there's a hero in front of that town that's actually got a better better army again. But they didn't come out and kill me, so maybe they're not that good. Okay, so that's that decision made. Doing this. Hopefully getting back, not making it. Okay, that stinks. So the loins aren't firing. So I'll just wait here. Buy some more unicorns tomorrow. Galar is coming to here. Shakti gives him the hourglass. No, what is it, this thing? It was that, wasn't it? Ring of Vitality. Come on. Let's do it. the wave. <laughs> Ring of the Wayfarer? What? No. What's this? <laughs> no, dude. Could Galar be any stupider? <laughs> oh, dude. The one that you need to give him is this. What is this? Combat speed of all my units goes up by plus one. That I really like. I want to wear that one. That's the ring of vitality that he wants, okay. Oh my god. Well, he gets an extra 500, that's because of the learning. Yes. Frost ring, ice bolt, lightning bolt. Oh, they're advanced anyway, okay. Um, I'm gonna go for that actually. I don't know which one to take here. I'm not sure. Okay, all right. Shakti. We decided he was going to. And then Shakti can be the one that hangs out down underneath. It's the less dangerous job, and he's got the bag of gold, yeah. Okay. Not visited, but I don't really want to invest. Is he there? You're there, you're there. You're here. Doing... What are you doing? Just some reveal? Day seven, I've only got 22 grand in the bank, which is not much. Let's go somewhere safe for the evening. Like, say, even here is fine, right? Spend the night. Get back to 400 spell points. Okay. Massive battle coming up here, the hardest battle probably we've fought so far in terms of... There's an orange hero that's capable of stuff. Who are you? Mo... Moandor! I'm sure I murdered Moandor. I did. I killed him. Right, it was week of the something that isn't played, so... More orange stuff down here. Right. 
There is a hero. Okay, male kiss. I think he would have ridden out to meet me if he could have. So I've got no resurrection here, right? So. <sighs> yeah. So just before I do dive in, is there a case? She can't cast visions, can she? She cannot. I can get her out of it. She doesn't have to do this. I gotta do two fights in a row. I gotta do this fight. Where male Kith's guys obviously are worse than mine, but he could cast something nasty and kill some stuff. Then I do the siege. Which is gonna to be touch and go. I don't think if he loses, I don't think he gets to fall back and fight me again in here, but there could be another hero back here anyway. That it's not telling me. Can always flee. Let's do it. Okay, so they don't get the benefit of the, the castle. Yeah, okay, that's good. Yeah, oh, he's a terrible hero. Excellent. He is utterly atrocious and I have no penalty for shooting. Oh, that's made me a lot happier. Um, happy to waste spell points. I don't know that I need to. What would I cast? I'm not sure. Okay, well done. Okay. 23 perish. Um, 300 odd hit points, hardly anything, 300 and something hit points, okay there. that should be the end of them, yeah, maybe just all tier 1 units, you know. So I shoot, I shoot twice. Maybe they all just, you know, are, are hopeless. Now he goes. Maybe they're all hopeless in the late game, you know, and that's just the way it is. All right, so I lost 24 of them, but they weren't really that important. Moment of tooth. Swarm. I think that's our first swarm. Oh, I'm procrastinating. Oh, come on. Damn, there's a hero. Is she good? Yes, she is. Oh. He? Oh. oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh, no, and they've piled into the Titans as well. <laughs> I'm actually gonna go for the Arrow Towers here, right? Because uh, getting the Nagas in. Yeah, and I have to save my spell points for Dispel. I shoot first. Could shoot the dragons. Seems unnecessary. Um, I have... 600 odd damage to deal. That would kill them. I think you'll find there's 500 there. What's 25? No, 25 by 20 would be 500. Yeah, so that'll kill the Medusas. That seems good. Did you see that? Save my dispel. Oh, that's good start, boys. Good start. <laughs> okay, the green dragon must have paused, but he can't get to me. Yes, this is a wait here, right? You're waiting, I'm waiting. There's a blind. No problem. So that stack is 900 HP. 
as is that one. I think I'm going to win. I think I might win. That's about a thousand there. And we don't know if they're sallying forth or not. I'm not sure who to have a go at, so I'll have a go at the biggest stack there. How about that? Man, I'm good at archery, aren't I? Okay, so these guys don't do as much as I thought they would. This has 700 left. This has about a thousand or nine hundred. Um, that's three sixty, so I can kill the two dragons. I like kills. Seem good. Oh man, the ballista with no penalty, like that's just excellent. Um, keep working on this, I suppose. Boom. Boom. Oh, ooh, handy, handy. Handy points. Oh, <laughs> you fool. And the troglodytes have blocked the unicorns from coming to help you. Oh, you moron. This has gone exceptionally well. The sheer power of expert archery, the golden bow. 20 attack. Oh, that was my mistake. Fair enough. Well, it'll be a miracle now I, that, if I don't lose one of them now. Um, that was silly. I did not see that the Minotaurs could walk around. Um, anyway, okay. So I can deal 180-odd, which kills about three of them. And then the Unicorns have their turn. But I don't think I need to, right? Because it's going to go Titans. Unicorns will have to wait because they're in the way. I don't know. Seems okay. I'm giving up on the Titan. They've done their job, haven't they? How many gargoyles did I lose? Three. Yeah, let's still just go for this. And I'll still just hold up to spell unless I can win the game. Yeah, that just kills about half of them. Okay. Not bad. I could cure, or I could just help make sure this happens. I deal two to three damage. All right, I'm blinding unicorns. That's happening. Then this is happening. I'm gonna see if you die. And now hopefully I can kill the rocks, and then I have all turned couldn't resist. How much do I? Yeah, you're dead. You do nothing. You do nothing. <laughs> Don't go for the Naga. Okay, it's alright. I really want to try to mitigate the risk of losing a Naga. Let's see if I can kill a tower. I've been trying all bloody fight to kill a tower. No, I can't kill a tower. I'm not going to get to attack with the gargoyles. Yeah, okay. Alright. Kill two? No, one lives. Okay, that's alright. I don't think... I don't think I lose another Naga. Okay. I think that's okay. I took probably too long to figure that out. Pretty good. Pretty good exchange in the end, you have to say. For Anya. And good experience for our second hero. Useful. Great. Expert dispel goes well with a disc the recanter's cloak. I've got expert. I'd have expert um, cure. I'd love expert earth though. Or expert air, actually. Mm. Don't think the case is strong enough over logistics for for that. Right, what do we got? 
half pie sort of town. Mage Guild has Scuttleboat, which no one knows yet. So she can pop in there and learn that. And of course it's day one. We're leveraging our day one advantage here. We could fill that up. We could buy all of them. And you know, this is our new base of operations. I'm gonna get this. Um and hopefully we can draw red into a massive fight with Labitha in this area. 